Okay, today we're going to be talking about how we can have a successful argument writing essay, which is what we've been doing in class. So let me go to the next slide, which will talk a little bit about the introduction. So in our introduction, you are going to, we have asked you to begin with a statistic or a quote to introduce your writing. And so what I did when I found a research about um, school uniforms it, that I felt was a really good um, explanation or some more information about what they are or how they've increased was the fact that um, public schools having the amount of public schools that have a strict dress code or school uniforms has increased by 10 percent which I thought was pretty fascinating. I also wanted to make sure when I wrote about their background information again giving our reader some more um, understanding of the material material we will be speaking about or talking about is that traditionally they were only worn by private school students. Um, and then in 1987, uh, they started becoming a little bit more um, popular in public schools as well. So this is my background info information. And then I finished off with my thesis statement. Although opponents say uniforms decrease bullying, Public schools should not require students to wear uniforms because they restrict individuality and are expensive. So in your introduction, we are looking for a statistic or quote, background information, and a thesis statement. Now well, let's go look at your thesis statement, break it down a little bit more. In your thesis statement, you should have your concession. What is the opponent's argument? What is their key argument? You're going to start with that. Make sure that you have a comma before you start talking about your thesis. For our class, it's either public schools should not require students to wear uniforms or public schools should require students to wear uniforms. Now remember, yours is about standards-based grading, but you, you will either have a should or you will have should not. And then finally, we're gonna end with our reasons. We're gonna have two reasons for this paper. Here's that because, which is a good um, signal word. Here's my first reason. They restrict individuality. And my second reason is because they are expensive. 